February 13th, 2014, 49 out of 50 states in the U.S. had snow on the ground. And what occurred with that, as I'm sure you can imagine, is a significant impact or assumption of impact on our assets. We had our Pi system uh, back to 98, but it was in a very reactive mode. It wasn't, we're actively monitoring and preventing. So we decided that proactive really just made more sense. Um, you have the ability to monitor email notifications, and then you can prevent those instances. When you take on a project of this size, it's not uncommon in the field to hear operations say, I just need the gas to flow. I just need the engine to run. I'm not worried about your computer stuff. The first time an email notification comes from our Pi system that saves a failure at their station, they really get it. So this is um, a visual, we call them dashboards, compressor station dashboards. So you have a few different decision-making opportunities and inputs to really see and get a view into what's going on. What we did uh, during the polar vortex was a few days prior to the weather coming, we actually had our operations analysts, they actually logged on and looked at every dashboard that represented their region. and looked for red, looked for yellow, made those phone calls to the field and say, something's looking a little funky on unit one at Lucas. Um, and that way, we're, that just goes back to the proactive nature of the system. Here's another visual. Mike, who's one of our ops analysts. Mike received an email notification, so he logged into Foresight, saw also that the fuel rate was low. So he called out to the compressor station. They uh, went out to the unit and Right after they bled the valve, as you can see, the fuel rate um, came right back up. We're at about 30 plus events now that we feel we've prevented um, based on our system, which is approximately $3 million. Just as important is the intangible benefits, because intangible also has just as much return. You may not be able to say at the beginning it's $2.8 million, but you know what? That first one, increased customer confidence, that's huge.